debt service funds. The rest of this chapter deals with this topic, which is, this is the last of the governmental funds we'll look at. General fund, special revenue fund, permanent fund, capital projects fund, and now, which is the last one? Debt service fund. Got it? Okay. What are debt service funds used for? Exactly what it says. To service debt. So do you see now why it's called fund accounting? Looks like everything we create a fund for, right? We like to segregate things. To, and why governments do that is to allow better control on how monies are spent, rather than mixing everything up, okay? So basically a debt service fund, so I go out to borrow some money. And let's say the town wants to borrow $10 million. It's going to pay off in 10 equal installments, a million every year because they bought an expensive piece of equipment which will last 10 years, so they make it things easy. When I go out to sell these bonds, the people buying the bonds say, okay, we'll give you the 10 million, but this is what we want you to do. Every year at the start of the year, before you do anything else, deposit the $1 million that's due at the end of the year, plus interest, into your debt service fund. We don't want to wait till the end of the year when the bill comes due. Make that deposit right at the very start. And you say, all right, it's required by something called a bond resolution or a bond indenture. That's the document that's, that we sometimes call, refer to. So where does the debt service fund get its money? From the general fund? Where does the general fund get its money from? Taxpayers? So the first year, what am I doing? I'm depositing in the debt service fund a million dollars plus interest on $10 million. Let's say it's 5%. So it's $500,000 that I now deposit, right? Plus the, interest. Plus the interest. And we need to keep it separate, as you will see. And then when it comes due, what do we do? We pay it off. Next year, what happens? It restarts again. That's all. That's it. That's debt service fund. When the bonds are paid, what do you do with the debt service fund? Closed. Do you carry the debt in debt service fund? No. Debt is never carried in debt service fund. Only resources used to pay principal and interest. So the resources, that's where they come from. Taxes, special assessments. Basically what Gasby says is, Again, only for general long-term liabilities. It says if you have 10 different debt issues, don't set up 10 different debt service funds. Maybe use one or two, depending on what it is. You don't have to necessarily set up one for every single debt service issue. I mean, every single debt issue. Now, there are two types of bonds. One is the very simple bond. Notice I use a very simple bond. And the other one's slightly more complicated.